All right, well, here we are. Game number two. Familiar sight to see with this day. Not at all a surprise. Oh, man. Okay. He really does just love to that's, that's a good move. That's such a go-to You're for blocking, Sam. I might break your shield. That's true. So it's, it's a little afraid. I mean, I'd definitely be a little afraid of it, too. But either way, Apollo Kage would have, I'd say, a better start right now. Yeah, essentially, it's just the riskier forward tilt, right? Yeah. Because the forward tilt's the grounded poke that you can hop over and punish Sephiroth for, but the down smash does that extra shield damage. Mm -hmm. So if you shield forward tilt, not a big deal. You shield down smash, your shield is going to be so sh small. That your counter pick stage kind of sucks. Yeah. Oh, oh it tried to set up a reverse. Okay. Hold there that to bear though. there. We could so crazy. comfortable here. The item control carries over from Diddy. I mean, you, you see him kind of tossing these grenades so Very easily. True. He just jabbed one of them just to stop it. Jabbing Gavin. <laughs> All right, buddy. <laughs> Got that proto notebook out too, I see. <laughs> Did you see him bait that, by the way? He baited like three back ears and he punished the last one. Apollo Kage, oh yeah, yeah, dude, he's, he's scared to death. He's gonna do it, yeah. Flare. And this Die. is just a break his soul. Oh! <laughs> Position a character that can tank quite a bit of hits. Oh. He can the Nair Strings out and into the up air. Oh, no, don't do it to him. Yeah, and I, the Nair Strings with Wing, it, there's so much more potent. You're able to just, sometimes you're able to triple jump mm. into that third Nair or whatnot, right? So you, and, and the Nairs are just doing more damage because you're right. in Wing. It, it kind of gets a little snowball-y, right? Yeah, the speed, the mobility. Like you said, just a better character. Oh, he cut that missile up. He diced it up. <laughs> the Octa Slash. I don't fully respect charged. your technology. Your <laughs> oh, military technology. Oh, oh. oh! How are we ending it? Okay, <laughs> okay. Not All right, let's see what the response will be here. You know, from, uh, you know, Jules down a little bit earlier. Forward air. Following up with the dash attack. Clean stuff, but we've seen Jules' combo game. 70% doesn't mean a whole lot to her. Especially not against Sephiroth. Yeah, no. We, we see, we've see we seen his comebacks be plentiful. That's catch with the upper right there. He's uh, trying to get uh, you know, a little creative there with the up B, like we mentioned. Both players uh, utilizing up B very nicely. Uh -huh. uh, Dropping the anvil, game. but look at that. It's zero to death from Tweak. She's been putting constant pressure on him anytime he goes near that crafting table. And I think that it's always fun to see which players do and do not know how to dodge that shadow curse. Yeah, yeah. And I feel like I, I cannot dodge it. I never have one successful. It's two full rotations. So keep your eye on one of the ball, and once it makes two full circles, then it pops. It's about a snake grenade. Yeah. About. Look, In terms of timing. I, I can't move. Oh! oh my God. Jab, three, three, jab three! Jab three! Jab three! Jab three! Tries to go for the finisher back air. Parries in there too. Another four tries attempt. Tweak adapting it just a little quicker than he expected. I mean, keep that early jump in mind too from Tweak to negate the back air coming out. Misses out on the up smash. Okay. Hey guys. Wait, hold okay. on. You, you might have called it into existence. You know. So why, I mean, you saw him bring it back last game. Trying to find himself in a similar position. Yep. They are really just yeah, kind of being well, super disciplined on in these interactions, you but have to be. illusioning right into them. And that's the thing, too. Like, Tweak has a huge lead, so he has no real reason to approach and yep. get up tilted by light yeah. and get hit by a huge combo. And Light Bethel doesn't Bear. really know how to get in there without. Oh God. My God. God. I'm never going to criticize any decision you make ever again because clearly that was not it. I'm the a Sephiroth fan. I'm, I'm a Sephiroth fan. I'm wondering maybe why not Wario? You know, there's there's some thoughts I have about matchups here that I'd love to talk to Tweak about later. Yep. But currently, we're dealing with the Sephiroth again. And Tweak, another player we did not expect to be on the verge of being 3-0. First it was Leo, and now it is Tweak. A lot of surprises. Big dash attack. That's a big button. Yeah. Forcing him off that. Good active frames, too. Oh! Where are you landing? There is a little bit of hope for Lo, you know? If you look really, really far down the tunnel for some light, there's the fact that Loaf wastes the one walk completely just for no reason, unforced error on that, um... Yes. I think it was second stock? It was first or second, I forget. It was, it was first. first. It was Yo, first, yeah. the Jephiroth, um, bro? It's when you combo jab into Sephiroth. Ooh, Ooh nice, nice. But it, I, don't, I don't know if that miss walk matters when Tweak is just whooping oh, your ass he like tried this. Keeping it composed here to keep things competitive. He did. It was a lot shorter than I think a lot of players. Um, yeah, I, yeah. I always tell new players, I was like, look, just run away for 10 seconds. They're like, what do you mean? I was like, if Mental you mess reset. up and you're yeah. tilted, just run away. Don't fight. They're reset. not going to approach you, trust me. Yeah, <laughs> they won't. <laughs> Have you seen the game we play? They're not going forward. <laughs> man, Tweak getting a lot of usage off this jab. Oh, man, Jeff oh, man. oh, he threw it out only once. Oh, very much uh, within Sauce's, within Sauce's uh, grasp here. 
That was a re-grab, but he was too worried about the Shadow Flare and, and its own detonation timer to tr properly punish. There's not many chances where you get to pressure Sephiroth on ledge, and any of those opportunities you want to take, oh, bravery, just to <laughs> ignore Dude, the Flare Blitz, get that grab. The way Tweak reacts to these Flare Blitzes, yeah, just totally... I, I mean, you could tell he used to be in this character. Or, two stocks quick work. have been gone! Yeah. It's been two minutes! Okay, that's the free damage into the back air. Tat oh, on no. the Dark Flare. Looking very scary. Oh, re -grab, re -grab, though. Oh, but the Octo so Slash smart. coming in the clutch! Yeah, what a savior in this down tilt just posing to be an issue. Thought that he was playing off, and they would be fantastic. But oh, oh the foot still it's the down. Are you kidding me? Got all that damage going down. Okay, Skeptic actually, by ledge. with a sitting duck there with the air dodge, Tweak having mercy on his soul. Okay. Oh my. That was almost a perfect setup. Trump into the curse. Look at that percent on Sonic's pileup. Need just one more good up. Oh my! Down with him versus Big D at main stage, right? The Diddy wasn't enough to get a dump with Seth coming through. Ah, yep. had the right idea on the counter. Yeah. But it just goes through it. That's illusion from Box is one of the hardest things to punish in this game. Like, it seems like it should be so simple just to like throw out a hitbox, but 95% of the time he just flanks straight through it. Not much you can do. He's actually still yeah. alive off of that nair. That's quite surprising. Yeah, that's playing this really well. I really feel like Light was just coming in there expecting Diddy Kong and this Sephiroth is a completely different look. Yeah. Yeah, it's a different battle plan because, like, you want to. Sephiroth, the idea, of course, on paper is to just rush him down, right? His frame data is kind of long. You don't want to keep. What is this? Yeah. It's like blank. Yeah. Like, look yeah. at yeah, it. Exactly. Respect it. Respect me. Respect me. Another one! Yeah. And because oh, you call them Skittles? I like them. I like that. And, the and there it is. Do you know that they all explode exactly at the same position? Yeah, and uh, they, the they go around right the top corner, right yeah. and then they drive. Yeah. This is where you have to shield all spot dodge. Or air dodge. Oh, they dodge, yes. Now going again for Nobby Fancy. Up Man. Here. I guess Gala oh, into combo? Something fancy ah, for sure. Yeah, he wants that lift with a clip, eh? That should be it. That Back to the ledge here. Yes. Back to the ledge again. Oh no. Messed up. I find it so funny that that grab on like Little he Mac or Cloud up. is guaranteed death of like zero. Oh, it's yeah, just it, so funny. It is truly the gates of hell for certain characters. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Gabby cleaning it up here quite a bit though. It's looking Ooh. a lot better than the first time. Like, oh, is he going to do this? Is Ooh. he going to do this? Like, Ooh. even though he was telegraphing the back air, uh, Riddles could have been like, oh, he's definitely trying to fake me out right here so that he can catch me. Mm -hmm. Alrighty. To Kalos we go. More space. FD, baby. Even yeah. But Riddles wants that right now against Tweak. Nice. Even though he lives a little longer, Sephiroth's hey. light enough for it to not matter. Tweak is calling out so many of these like spot dodges, these drop shields, like everything. He's not letting Riddles like be defensive at all. Right. <laughs> Playing super clean, man. Riddles though yeah. again, like dead even game, right? Especially with Rage Drive ready to go. Rage art. And honestly, I really want to see Oh, he's dead. See ya.